Welcome back to the Pokemon Crystal Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge with your host, a slightly sick Junjun. You can probably tell by my voice that I'm not 100%, but I'm like a solid 75, you know? I feel better than I did in the morning at work at 6 in the morning. Pokemon Crystal Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge, welcome back. This is episode 13, I think this is episode 13. I'm sorry if I have to check ahead of time. But we're going to do a quick team recap. If you watched the last episode, we beat Morty, did some stuff in Necrotique, moving on. We're going to have a lot of encounters this episode, I think. I think we're going to have a good bit. Team recap, start off with Sting the Gligar with Cut, Quick Attack, Metal Claw, Acid, with Slater Gator, the Kraken, uh, with Scratch, Bite, Rage, and Surf. Finally getting Surf. We have Surf on like half our team. Sea Cow, the Duke, on Aurora, Beam, Surf, Headbutt, Slash, we got Poseidon, the Dratini, replacing Dear Old Rex, Dragon, Rage, Twister, Thunder, Wave, and Surf. Surf again. <laughs> surf is everywhere. And Insane Difficulty, the Dunsparce, our starter, when in doubt, Dunsparce out, Rage, Defense, Girl, Claire, and Slash. And oh, yeah, the Frost Science, he's in there too, Sorry, Science of Grammar, with Sludge, Pound, Minimize, and Poison Gas. He's gay. I love Grammar. He helped me out a lot in that last episode. If you saw it, I'll tell you. He, science helped out a good bit in that gym. He was the man. Okay, we need to stock up. We got a good bit of cash. Buy eight Great Balls. I'm gonna buy five Pokeballs and some Stuper Potions. Stuper Potions. Good, good. Okay, so. Like I said, I think we'll have a decent bit of encounters in this episode. I'm not sure exactly how many. I'm just I'm not really thinking ahead, I'm just kinda of saying things. That's what Jun Juns do. That's what Jun Juns do best. I have one up here actually, in that Critique City itself. Cause I can surf now. Rather than use the rod. I used the fishing rod last time I got croconaut. Considering it's an old rod, I don't know if it'll be croconaut every time. Which, if it is, I don't, I don't want to find out if it is, because if it is, I'll be really upset that I wasted the Master Ball on Slater Gator. So I don't want to find out if it's going to be the same Pokemon every time like the old rod typically is with Magikarp. So I'm going to Surf. And we're going to Surf. And we're going to Surf. And we're going to get something, something good. Yeah! Voltor. Voltor. New. Something I don't have. So. I'll accept it. I'll take it. As long as I don't kill it. Uh, which is possible, not likely. It is improbable, but not impossible. Ooh, okay. Down to the red. Uh, I can probably catch it now, but. I'll use a glare just for just for the the lulls and the catches and the bokies and the voltorbs and the dunsparses. Uh, I need to use some of these TMs. I need to find people who can take these TMs. Pokeball, go! Pokeball, catch the Pokeball. With a face. You guys are brothers. Brother! Brother! That's your name, Voltorb. Brother! All my Voltorb maniacs out there, brother. 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 Okay, we're done with that. Wait, how did I even start doing that in the first place? I don't even remember how. Oh, because uh, cause the Pokeball. Because I called them brothers, that's right. There's one encounter down. Brother. Um, oh, random item. Random item. Max Ether. Cool. Cool. I'll take it. I'll take it. Um, so I'm going to have an encounter on this route. So we'll surf for that. <laughs> no! <coughs> No! This is what I said I wanted the Master Ball for! 
This is exactly what I said I wanted the Master Ball for! Oh, I used it because I didn't think it would be likely I would run into a Dragonite or a Tyranitar. <sighs> really? <laughs> I didn't think it would be likely I'd actually run into one. I'm gonna I'm gonna at least try a little bit I don't want to try to the point where I use every single one of my pokeballs but I want to at least try a little bit can't believe that I mean we have Poseidon I could if I really wanted to technically call species clause because we have Poseidon <sighs> I probably should have done that I don't want to call species clause now after I've already started the battle because I feel like that'd be kind of cheap I think I technically could but I feel like that would be kind of cheap if I did that so I'm not going to call species clause oh, I really should have because I'm not I'm not gonna catch this. <laughs> I mean, like I was gonna say, I was gonna say this. We have Poseidon. As long as he stays alive, he'll be a, Dr a Dratini. He'll be a Dragonite eventually. But man, is that far away. That is far, far away. Um, what's the weakest thing I can hit you with? I feel like a water gun from Slater Gator would be pretty weak. So let's try that. Oh, I don't have water gun anymore. Okay, um. Let's, let's see if we can. I know I'm not gonna catch it as is. We're gonna try a rage. See if we can get it to the red. If we kill it, we kill it. Okay. I'll say if he doesn't attack me, I'm pretty sure he can take one more, barring a critical. Okay. This is going to be a fun time. Trying to catch this Dragonite with great balls. It's going to break out right away. Man. It didn't so much as even try to surrender. <laughs> I'm not gonna try too many of these. If it's obvious, it's not gonna work. Wow. What a fighter. Let me see what this one more great ball does here. Oh my god, I thought I had it. Jeez, I thought I actually had it. See, now it wants me to keep going. That's what it's doing. It wants me to keep on throwing the Pokeballs at it. Because it knows. It, it's tricking me into thinking it's going to surrender. But it's not. Slayer Gator, you just had to make me use the freaking Master Ball on you. You're such a bad person. You just caught it with a great ball. Oh, God. Oh! <laughs> Poseidon, I'm sorry, but you're out. <laughs> you're out, kid. I'm sorry. What? My God. Ah! Ah! It is said that somewhere in the ocean lies an island where these gather. Only they live there. Whew. With a great ball. It only took like, what, five of them, maybe? 
Not bad. Not bad at all. Um, name, 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 name. I'll tell you what. I feel bad that Poseidon is going to get booted out of the party so easily. So, Poseidon. Point. Wait, are there? No, can you do numbers? You do numbers, can you? Can you do numbers? I thought you could do numbers. Okay. We'll do Poseidon the second. Um, I want to make. Sure, I don't think I spelled that right. Hold on. Because I, I felt like it was I E, but then I also felt like I always spell Poseidon wrong. No, it is E I. Okay, I do. No, I did. I was thinking the right way. I was thinking correctly. Oh boy. Welcome Poseidon the second. That's a capture. That is a capture. <laughs> oh man. Slater Gator, you had the cool capture thus far, but my god, you just got beat. I'm sorry, you just got beat, Slater Gator. Poseidon, I'm so sorry. But you're you're going in the box for now. Unless I have... God forbid, unless Poseidon the second go down. <sighs> Who else do I have in here? I don't even remember anyone else anymore. Big Bay! Oh, Sea Queen, I miss you. Um, I want to I wanna see something. I focus. Is there any one of them? For some reason, I thought there was more than one of my dead box. Mistakenly, but we're good, we're good. Poseidon the second. I don't know. Well, what? If, I always forget this. What item did Dratini have? Poseidon. Sorry, Poseidon. What item did Poseidon have? I don't remember. What did you have? Are you able to just take the item from it? Someone tell me this. Am I? Because I don't feel like checking. I'm lazy. Are you able to just take the item from it while it's in the box? Because I don't feel like you can. Oh, it was quick claw. I thought it might be quick quick claw. So I'm glad I grabbed that. But I thought I gave it to him. I thought he was the slowest one. <sighs> I can't believe I caught that thing. I'm really glad I didn't call species claws. Because I thought for sure. For sure there was no way I was catching that thing. I am, you know what, I was so mad that I used the Great Ball and Slater Gator, I'm not even mad anymore. Because now I got both, I got both a Pseudo Legendary and Slater Gator. I'm happy. Who's the slowest on the team? Who, aka who needs the Quick Claw, is what I'm really asking. Except for Dunsparce, you're keeping the leftovers no matter what you say, I don't care. 36 for Slater Gator. 36, 26 for Sign, he has the Poison Barb. You're 36 as well. And you're fully evolved. So I'm going to give you the quick claw anyway. Because I don't want to take the poison bar from science. I don't want to take the leftovers from insane difficulty. It's all you. Slater Gator has another evolution still, so I'm not overly concerned with his stats quite yet. Heal me up. Okay, um, what now? So, I want to, I, I should probably check you out, Poseidon, for check you out. Mm -hmm. What do you got as far as attacks? Rappler, Thunderweight, Twister. Okay, so pretty standard. Let's see how you are with my TMs I have. I doubt you can learn pretty much any of them, but it'd be, sure it'd be nice. No. Nope, oh, oh, oh. Well, I know you can learn Surf. And that's what I want to give you. Just like Poseidon had. Good old Poseidon. Leer. Um, what did... Oh, he had Poseidon a Dragon Rage, too. I was going to say, he had something else that Poseidon the second doesn't have. Dragon Rage, that's it. Okay, we can actually do another encounter over where I just was, though, because... Um, how many great balls after that last one? 
So eight of each. It's not bad. That's good enough for me. Um, I can still do an encounter in this cave. Which cave is this? Mount Mortar. Okay. Mount Mortar. So I can still do my encounter in here. I actually don't know much about this cave at all. But... Much up! So, alright. It's a thing. <laughs> it's a fighting type, which I don't think we actually have. I would say switch Insane Difficulty out, because it's a fighting type, but... I know we learned this lesson with Rex, but this cannot do that much. Thank you. I was going to say, there's no way it's going to do that much. I think you can handle another rage. I think. I want to say yes. Nope. Just kidding. You are out. You are out of there. Okay. That was quick. <laughs> no go there. So we're going back. We're going the other way. I'm going to stop at the Pokemon Center one more time just to heal before we move on. So we're going to fast forward a little bit. No big deal. So we're going to do the Burn Tower. I'm not worried about the Tin Tower right now. That doesn't necessarily matter. So we're going to go over here. We can get another encounter. And we'll have some trainer battles as well. So let's get our encounter first and foremost. Before anything else. Hope for something nice. Hope for something pretty. Like a Vulpix, I like it. Ninetales is up there for one of my favorite Pokemon. It's it's always been between Houndoom and Arcanine, with Ninetales like very slightly back in third. I love fire types, if you can't tell. And I don't have any. I need fire types. Wow, that was a powerful rage. No, it roared me out. Come on, I was about to catch it. I would have put that thing in my party probably too. Oh, why do you gotta do this to me? That's not cool! And yes, that does still count. That does still count as my one encounter. Wait, do I even need to go back to the book? I don't, I don't even need to go back. I probably would put that in my party, because I love Ninetales so much. <laughs> I mean, finding Firestone would not have been easy. But, oh my god, that was not cool. What are you doing? You're really gonna do me like that? I'm so disappointed. <laughs> I, I'm very well might have used that. I don't have a fire type. I don't. I haven't had a fire type this whole let's play. <sighs> what a bummer. I can't believe that has to count. Every buff. If Poseidon the second cannot handle this ugly buff, I quit Pokemon forever. We're gonna stay on strike, even if it takes forever. My sick, cracky voice. Oh, look at that. Oko, Oko, what? Oh no, Oko. Beside in the second. Your skill is world class, kid. Thanks, Sailor Man. <laughs> Battle mate. your butt and you figure it out yourself little girl lazy Wayne this is a great name mischievous this was my uh, shiny in my uh, test test run you know, the encounter later maybe, it's, maybe me telling me this to make it less fun when the time comes but yes the Gyarados we encounter later will still be a shiny the random this was my shiny in my test run. It was a shiny mischievous. Mischievous. I'm guessing Surf would be stronger than Twister. Even with the stab. Because Twister is a very weak attack. Twister. Oh, you got this, Poseidon, the second. I actually don't know how Sideway works. I know it's... I feel like it's like a set damage move of some sort, but I don't know, I don't know if it's like the one that's like, it does whatever your level is, or just, like, it doesn't do 20, that much we know, or it's like, like a quarter of what you have or something maybe, I don't know, that's kind of what it seemed like, because it seemed like it did more the first time, but I could just be imagining things. <laughs> okay, so now we're probably not going to be using Surf. Twister! Twister! 
It's a twister. Get it. Get it. Go down. Oh, what's gonna be a two hitter? I can take that. You can take that Poseidon. God, you're gonna level up so slow. You're gonna level up super, super slow, dude. <laughs> it's gonna take a while. It's cool, it's cool. It's cool, we'll get you there. We'll get you there. I'm debating the grinding montage for Poseidon a second. Normally I would do one for new members to catch them up. And Poseidon a second is going to take a good, good bit of experience to catch up. Um, the, oh, oh, the two same sprites right there. The only thing is, Dragonite's such a powerful Pokemon, I almost want to wonder if it doesn't necessarily need caught up quite. I think it, it still might, because the gym leader levels are going to start spiking up a decent bit. We're gonna want to make sure that we're ready for that. So we may do grinding next episode for Poseidon the second. Man, I'm not positive on that yet. If we don't, we'll, we'll probably do it the episode after. So we'll see if I'm uh, we'll see if I'm feeling frisky. You know what I'm saying? We'll see what what I decide to do. So surf that monkey. With the weird hand on its butt. So tired. I just want to go to sleep. Sorry about it. Ride that surf! Pokemon Steam is such a great game. I'm gonna play that. I'm gonna do that for a casual let's play soon. Let's casually play every Friday, except the last like two or three months worth of Fridays because I haven't been able to. I should address that. In fact, there hasn't been an LCP in a long time. That's a my bad, y'all. Ladian! Man! Wait, what did I call it? Manbug. I think it was the name of mine. Manbug the Ledian. Ledian! Is there a man? No, that's a, that's, a, that's a ladybug. Manbug's gonna be one of those captures you just know I'm never gonna use. I don't even think Ledian's good anyway, is it? I don't think it has good stats. I think I looked it up once for competitive purposes to see what it was like. I think maybe because I had a good ability or something, I was wondering about it, but eh, I remember its stats just not being there. Ugh, you just have to have that high attack stat. Okay, stop. Stop. Um, I can switch, but I really want to level you up as much as I can. So, I want to see if you can finish this off yourself. I'm sorry if I'm talking super quiet in this episode, by the way. It's just that bad mixture of being sick and being tired, and I'm just sitting here like, Yeah, let's play Pokemon. Yeah. We'll be good soon. No problem. Do my best. I got this. I got this. It's that time of year. You know, I get sick. I get, I literally get sick like once a year. Twice if I'm really unlucky. I got sick when I was a kid all the time. Got them antibodies built up, bro. So now I'm like, I'm very, very rarely sick. It's, it seems like once like every winter, I get like a cold. Or like, I get like a bad cough usually all of the time. And now is that time. So I'll be like this for a week or so, and then uh, we'll be good for the next year. It's, that's how it's always been for me. Once every winter. Every now and then, maybe something completely random will happen. But that's it. We'll be good soon. I think this is a bird keeper normally. Or maybe it's the schoolboy, because he just said something he learned. <laughs> yeah, it's the schoolboy. My bad. Nope, just kidding, it's the swimmer. Chloe. It's a swimmer male, but it still has a female name. I said, I don't know. Oh, I can't hit super effective damage on this one. Neat. Neat. 
ride that surf. Me Sir Poseidon, no, me Sir Poseidon, no, here. Because this is Poseidon the second. That Dragonite, though. That all powerful Dragonite. I run a Dragonite in my competitive team on Pokemon X. My god, that thing is a monster. I love it. That's like my MVP by far. Dragon Dance, Dragonite. Where it's at, man. Dragon Dance, that weakness policy, and that, what is it called? What's that ability called? Something scale, is it Marvel scale? Or is that the one Dragon Dare has? It's something. It's something scale, you know. One of those abilities that makes him awesome. Makes him total man. Giving me all my strategies. Don't battle me. I'm actually really not that good at competitive battling. I'm really not. I never ever did competitive battling until Pokemon X. Actually, that was the only reason I bought X. I didn't want X at all. Like, I didn't think X and Y looked all that great at first. I didn't want them. And then I was thinking, like, I really want to try to get into the competitive battling for once. And like, if I'm gonna like battle competitively, like online or like even like with other people, I'm gonna need to get X or Y. So I got X. And I actually ended up loving the game. Loved it. I thought it was fantastic. Sneasel. I wish I would have had a Sneasel. I love Weavile too. I'll point that out. Weavile is one of my favorite Pokemon. But this is a nice time to him. Anyway, so yeah, I bought. Uh, got Pokemon X. And uh, it was fantastic. I loved it so much. So much more than I thought it would. But yeah. Um, so I do not have much competitive battling experience. <laughs> not that great at it, but I mean, I'll give it. I'll, I'll try it. I try it every now and then, you know. I tried with Showdown. I think I might have a winning record on Showdown, but if I do, it's super, super close. I'm right. I think I'm right around 500. I was gonna um do some Showdown videos in this channel eventually. I'll get to it someday, but I'm warning you guys now. It's not pretty watching me do competitive battling. There's no other way to put it. I am not the best at it. Straight up. Jack and Dapper, that's dangerous. But at the same time, unless it's packing a weird ice attack or a weird dragon attack, a rock that matter, or if it survives, you know, we I we I. Poseidon 2 got this. I want him to just sweep everything. The only thing I'm iffy about with him sweeping everything himself is no one else is going to get the experience they need. So I might end up having to do grinding no matter what. Because I'm not about to go into a gym super, super under leveled. I mean, I don't think I'm too bad right now. What was Morty's ace? 25? Five, I think so. I actually was technically under leveled for that gym because all my guys were 23 or 24. I might have had a 125 guy, I'm not sure. But yeah, I was actually pretty under leveled. Slightly for Morty. So I might have to grind no matter what, at least a little bit, just to make sure everybody's where they need to be because I'm not trying to get wrecked at a gym. By who the next trainer? Gym leaders. Chuck is next. Then Jasmine. Is that her name? Jasmine? The law line. I think that's it. Then Price. And Claire. I could keep you out. I'm gonna keep you out for the experience. I'm gonna heal you from not trying to risk a crit. Both side in a second. We just got you. We're not losing you yet, boy. We ain't losing you yet, man. You hang in there. There you go. There you go. You got this. Finish it off. Finish off that special defensive tank. There we go. Level 20. So we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere with him. Before you know it, he'll be there. Oh, this was the this was the uh, the 
bird, what, what are they called? What's their actual thing called? Is it bird something, flying something? Is it like bird catcher, maybe? It's probably bird catcher, I don't even know. That was what I was thinking of, because I said, I thought the one in the corner was, but it was the schoolboy. That must be what I was thinking of. Um, I think we got all the trainers here, in this general spot. I, I'm sure there's more further down, I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's a death. Back to the grass. Back to the pile. Why can I have found that instead of Vulpix? Because I'm still getting a fire type. Still getting one of my favorite Pokemon. And getting one that won't roar me away. Which would have been phenomenal. Would have been great. But, what are you going to do? That's the way the Nuzlocke works. The randomizer Nuzlocke. Never know what you're going to get. Mom always said life was like a randomizer Nuzlocke. You never know what you're going to get. That's what he should have said in the movie. That makes a lot more sense than a box of chocolates. Because you can just open the box of chocolates and look at what you're going to get. Right? I mean, you should be able to tell the difference with some of them. Don't they, like, you know, have a key? I'm pretty sure most box of chocolates have a key. This is like, yo, this piece is this, and this piece is this. So, <laughs> Forrest, I think I know what I'm going to get. Life is like a randomizer Nuzlocke. You never know what you're gonna get. Wise words from your pal John John. Never forget. Boom. That is a shrew. What animal is a sand shrew? Actually, isn't is a shrew, isn't a shrew an actual animal? It's like a mouse of some sort, I think. Sand slash always makes me think of a hedgehog. Like every time I see sand sand slash. Every time I see Sand Slash, that's what I think of as a hedgehog. But I think a shrew is an actual animal. I think it's like a mouse of some sort. But I don't know. It's a mouse who lives in sand. It's a sand shrew. It's a sand shrew. Move. Okay, um, so we got the farm over here. I don't have many berries. Wait, what is it? Did I pick it up? Pack is full. Oh, pack is full. Um, is there anything in here I can literally just toss. I mean, mint berry is not that special, really, but... No, I don't want to toss any of that. Yeah, I don't have many berries to get to this milk tank. My milk tank ain't giving me milk no more, I reckon. This here farm's got famous milk. Most everyone wants a drink. It'll give me lots of milk if and I feed it lots of berries, I reckon. Country accent. Oh, it's, yeah, yeah. I don't have many berries for you, Mill Tank, but I'll give you what I got. There you go. I think I only have one. Uh, yep, I only have one. Sorry, I'll come back. <laughs> I'll come back for you, Mill Tank. Don't worry. I won't forget you. Let's show a Pokemon together at the same time. Okay. I'm sorry, that's my, that's my reaction. Okay. Let's do it. Chef Wellington. Chef Wellington? Isn't Wellington like an actual like food? Beef Wellington, something like that. That's a thing. Ah, uh, it's just Twister. Because Surf won't do too much, I reckon. Surf won't do too much, I reckon. Mm-hmm. Oh, Twister won't either. Well, I'm gonna fast forward this one a little bit because it's gonna be a slow battle. Otherwise, I'm s I hate that fast forward makes my capture program lag. But I used Twister and took it out a million times. Chef Wellington, Beef Wellington was defeated. Well, come, 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 everybody! You only have whatever more episodes to never get explodes. I'm never gonna have Pikachu. Pikachu, dude. Everyone's seen a Pikachu. You can't brag about these things. What, you mean your kid? Is that what you're bragging about? Your kid's a Pikachu. You trying to brag about your kid? 
I don't want to hear it. You ain't have Pikachu. You have an unknown. You can't brag about an unknown. Well, you kind of can, because that's actually like, mysterious. That's mysterious stuff, man. You walk up to someone with an unknown, they're like, dude, what is that thing? You come up to me in this game with an unknown, you're like, I'm like, dude, you got like the most worthless Pokemon. Step your game up. Look, that was super effective, and it did like negative seven damage. You ain't nothing. Unknown A, Bro Tractor. I, I stole that from Nate Wants the Battle, sorry. That name, Bro Tractor. That was good. I actually really liked that name. It looks like a protractor. You get it? Get it? Um, new route? It has to be a new route. Um, when did... Hold on. When did the route change? This has to be a new route. 39. 38. So this is a new route. <laughs> but... I wasn't paying attention. When does the thing pop up saying it changed? Right here. Right? Okay. So this is this is a new app. Fantastic, fantastic. You know what that means, ladies and gentlemen. That means we can get a new encounter. Sacks are for your feet, silly. Um, I'm gonna give you a potion first, just to be safe. God forbid I run into something totally out of this freaking world. I'm not saying I'm worried about you. Just you know, saying you know, you know. Yeah, you guys know. Give me an encounter! I told you guys we're gonna have a lot of encounters today. I told you. I told you. You should always listen to the Junjun. You should always listen to the Junjun. And Quilfus. Quilfus! God. I mean. Had some cool encounters today. Wait, wait, which way would it be in the video? It'd be that that way. Beside in a second. That's a cool encounter. We've had some of this. Some quillfish in my chops and roar users and voltorbs. <laughs> what are you gonna do? I'm hoping this will be an easy catch, because I don't feel... Really? You're a quillfish. Accept it. Accept your fate. Yo, I don't feel like playing with you. Do you wave it? No. Do you wave it? Do you wave it? There you go. Why am I... Why am I, like, leaving my face cam? What am I doing? I'm just, like, really moving down here. I'm chilling, yo. I'm chilling. Catch it. Stand there. Oh, it's a female too, which means I can name it Mrs. Puff. <coughs> Get in that Pokeball. Get in that ball. Get in that ball. I just picture someone like stuffing a puffer fish into a ball. <laughs> That's me. Don't do that. Don't do that, kids. I didn't say that. Listen. Fine, you can have a great ball. If you feel like you really deserve it, if you really feel that special, you have a great ball. Okay? What are you fighting? You're a quillfish! Why are you so against this? What 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 are you gonna do in your spare time? If you're not on my team? What, what are you gonna do? Just, just bounce around in the grass? Then you, you know, dying because you have gills? Yeah, is that what you're gonna do? Just you know, hop around on a stage with your little, with your little outfits? What do you want from me, Lindsay? What do you want? I'll tell you what you want. You want nothing. Yeah, because every man knows that every woman everywhere. Oh, what's the line? I forget it now. <laughs> I ruined it. Um, I, I ruined the line. I'm sorry, Family Guy fans. I just blew it. I had it. I, I ruined it. Does minimize lower your capture rate? Is that what's going on? Because I did not think a quillfish would be hard to catch at all. I thought this would be simple. I thought it'd be a gimme. I am not understanding this. I really wanted a Mrs. Puff just to name it Mrs. Puff. 
I'll throw one more Pokeball. If it doesn't catch this, I'm taking it out. I'm gonna body it. Like, I'm not playing around with it. I only want to catch it so I can name it Mrs. Puff and put it in the box forever. The the color matches the Gulfish perfectly, I'm just saying. Color the ball. I don't know why you fought so much. I don't, like I said, I don't know if Minimize changes the capture rate, but that thing fought like crazy. I did not think Quillfish would be that hard to capture. That's going to fit nicely. Oops, I need upper. It's going to fit nicely. Mrs. Puff! What our fucking bonus goal today is! Blankety! Blankety! Blank! Oh, uh, about you now. I'm assuming you're a trainer? Wait, what are you? Oh, that's, that's weird. I should get. Oh man, it'll be dark. Oh, I thought about him. It'll be dark in like 10 minutes, but I'm gonna be ending this video before then. So. Yeah. I don't know. That was creepy. I don't know what that lady is doing. Is she, does she bow you only at night? Does she give you something? I don't, I don't know these things, guys. Maybe next episode, if I'm doing it, if I'm filming at night, maybe we'll get to do it then. We'll find out. We'll see what happens. I feel like we're, we're pretty close to my time limit here. I try not to go past, like, I try to be around 45 minutes. I was way over in the last episode. I apologize for that. I was over an hour in the last episode. Because there was a moment for like, a, there was a five minute period where I was trying to find the answer to something online and I totally forgot to cut it out of the video. So, literally, just me sitting there for five minutes staring at my iPod. I totally forgot to cut it out. I mean, the video still, out of way, would have ran long. I'm trying to keep them all around 45 minutes. Which is better than when I have my old camera, it maxed me at like 25 minutes or something like that, no matter what I did. So, this is nice. That's why I love this new camera. I can go for 45 minutes, which is what I originally wanted in the first place. So, I'm happy. I'm happy, John John. Happy, sick John John. With a mustache. Oh, come on. Just keep up. The day a Metapod beats a Dragonite is the day Jun Jun quits YouTube's forever. Nobody challenge that. I don't want to see someone like post a video response. If I'm a Metapod beating a Dragonite, don't do that. Just forget I said anything. Is there anything ever? No? Okay. We're gonna go. Um, we're gonna run into our buddy in here, but we're not. I don't think we're gonna battle. I'm going to be 100% safe, throw somebody fresh up front, I'm 99% sure there's not going to be a battle right here. Right here. It's probably taking, I don't remember the voice I gave him. Here was sick Pokemon at the lighthouse. <laughs> Boo hoo! Just let sick Pokemon go. A Pokemon that can't battle is worthless. Why don't you go train at the lighthouse? Am I getting I'm getting like Scottish without even realizing? Who knows? It may make you a bit less weak. <laughs> I was humming the music there, and then as I said in another episode, I don't actually have speakers connected when I have my microphone plugged in, so. I could have been way off from that song, I have no idea. But that doesn't matter because the episode's over. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Go down below, I don't and I, I never say this, but go down below at the bottom of this video. There's a link to my Facebook and my Twitter. Get on this. Like my Facebook page. Follow me on Twitter. Come back for the next episode of the Pokemon Crystal Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge. My name is John John. Have a beautiful day, ladies and gentlemen.